Hey everyone! Today we got get start a new project. We will make a parasol, and for today the first part, we will make a, a rigging of the parasol by using the blender constraint. Uh, we can use several constraints to have this beautiful result like this. Okay, let's go. Alright, here I get the scene for you. The pole of the parasol, I put the pivot on the ground, and the pusher, I put the pivot on the top, and uh, the short stick on the top, and the long stick pivot on top as well. And top block, and the empty object. Now everything is separate. I parent the pusher to the pole at first, and next we will parent the top block to pole as well. They move together now, and next we move the long stick to the side of the pole, and parent it to the top block as well. Now everything move together except uh, the st short stick. So we move it to the side of the pusher and adjust a little bit uh, the rotation of the long stick. Uh, make it open a little bit, yes. And uh, we don't need another direction, so we lock down them and we move the empty object to the cross point of these two stick, and uh, then we rotate the direction, make it follow the direction of the long stick. And uh, next, we can parent this uh, empty object to long stick. They will move follow the long stick, like so. And next thing, we will parent the short sticker to the empty object as well. You see, they didn't uh, follow the the pole. Now, parent, uh, we adjust a little bit uh, the precisely adjust uh, the position of this uh, start point of the short stick, make it precisely to the cross point of this empty object and the long stick. Now, looking good, and uh, parent short stick to empty object. So now, they just move together, and uh, the first thing we'll do is select the long sticker, get the transformation constraint, and uh, the push will up and down, and uh, the long sticker will rotate. The pusher lowest position is 1.4, and the highest position will give a 2.1. And uh, for the rotation of long sticker, the biggest uh, angle I think is uh, negative 60 degree about. So here we from location map to rotation. Location is uh, up down of the upper the pusher. So the lowest point is the 1.4. Highest position is 2.1 just like and uh, for the rotation of this long sticker uh, the minimum angle is zero and the maximum is a negative 60 degree and x source axis we select as z because the pusher movement up and down in z direction and the target we select the pusher now we get the movement to uh, correctly but we will limit the pusher 
between 1.4 and 2.1 in the lead direction use this limit location constraint so check z direction and affect transform for the lowest is 1.4 and the highest is 2.1 and now we limit the movement of the pusher it will don't go anywhere so but We don't need to move to another direction, so we just lock down. Next, uh, we will get uh, the short stick point to pusher. So we select it and uh, give it a uh, track to constraint. Select pusher as, as a target. So now we move the when we move the pusher, it will always point to the pusher. But we notice that there is a little distance here, so we need to make a little bit uh, adjustment. Select this long sticker and uh, adjust a little bit of the uh, max angle here. I think I'm gonna lower a little bit to like 57 degree make it just a touch to the pusher okay now it works correctly okay now we will copy this structure around the holder we select the short sticker empty object and uh, the long sticker they change transform people to 3D crystal and they change top view we make a copy shift D and rotate it to negative 47 degree so everything being copied even the constraint so it will move as well. That's really good. So it just saved me a lot of time to connect every constraint again. So I really like this feature of this blender. And uh, continue to copy the next one and uh, rotate another 45 degree. And it will continue to copy and here the six, the same thing, six uh, structure, another 45, another 45. Just uh, shift D and uh, right click and R and input in negative 45. We repeat this step and then uh, voila. The structure is down. The rigging is down for the parasolar. This is great. If you need this blend file, I put it on my Patreon. You can click the link below to get it. And thank you very much for watching. We'll see you to next part. Bye.